Pixar movies are not just some of the best animated movies of the 21st century, some of them are probably my favorite movies ever. I mean, the very first Pixar movie was Toy Story, released the same year I was born, so I definitely feel a connection here. For decades, Pixar movies have been revolutionizing animation and storytelling. No matter how good or bad a Pixar movie is, they all seem to have some social commentary or life lesson written into the story. And today, I'm gonna cover the one most important lesson from every Pixar movie in 10 minutes, which means I only have about 9 minutes left, okay? Before I begin, two quick things. First, I won't cover any of the premises, but most of these lessons will likely be indirect spoilers if you haven't seen the movie itself. Second, it's fairly common for Pixar movies to have multiple lessons, so if you think I missed the most important lesson from the movie, tell me what you think in the comments below. Ready? Okay, let's begin. Toy Story is about how we respond to changes in our lives which make people pay less attention to us, most notably the addition of a new family or group member. It teaches us how to overcome jealousy and learn to coexist with people we are not familiar with. A Bug's Life teaches us to listen to creative ideas in order to solve big world problems. Inventors and innovators may have crazy sounding ideas, but those ideas coupled with leadership and vision can be used to break barriers and stop cycles of inefficiency. Toy Story 2 tells us to be careful of superficial and temporary fame and attention, and how these can seduce us or distract us from being with the people who love us now. It's because of this that we shouldn't be afraid of not being loved or being forgotten. Monsters Inc's lesson is simple. People fear what they do not understand. This lesson is creatively portrayed in the film by the bravest monsters who scare children only because they believe the children are toxic and don't understand how harmless they really are. Differences do not equal dangerous. Finding Nemo teaches parents that the world can be full of danger and evil, but sheltering children too much can harm them in the long run. It's a film about achieving balance in parenting and how we can help the younger generation be more independent. One of the best superhero movies of all time, The Incredibles uses a midlife crisis to hide a story about being the best version of yourself. Because everyone has their own superpower in their own way, and we shouldn't hold them back from using their talents for the forces of good. Cars tells us how to be humble and willing to learn. You may be the best at a certain skill, but that's no reason to feel entitled. Life is about continuously learning something new from the people you meet and the new situations you encounter, and using what you've learned to be adaptable. Ratatouille is about learning to overcome bias and accepting unconventional changes. No one would ever imagine letting a rat into the kitchen since it's a symbol for filth, poor hygiene, and disease. Ooh, getting chills just thinking about it. But the film smartly helps us humans see past our biases and buck convention. Containing one of the strongest political commentaries in this list, Wally -E warns us of the dangers of consumerism and relying too much on technology to support our happiness and satisfaction while the natural world around us falls into decay. It's a beautiful look at the crossroads between the environment, technology, and humanity. While giving us a masterclass on how to make grown-ups cry, Up is ultimately about learning to let go. The fact of life is that oftentimes we encounter sad events that change how we live, and while we can take time to be sad, we eventually have to let go and continue the adventure our lives were meant to be. Toy Story 3 is in many ways another film about letting go, but Toy Story films always seem to have a more existential feel because of the nature of the characters. The film teaches us that love changes over time, but even if we outgrow our friends or they outgrow us, 
There are endless opportunities to be loved by others if we open our hearts and minds. This was a fantastic film and deserved its Best Picture Oscar nomination, in my opinion. And then we come to probably the opposite of that with Cars 2, which does have its share of lessons as well. Cars 2 is really about not looking down on the people who we would normally dismiss because they can be resourceful in their own way. Brave is about freedom, equality, but above all else, family. The bonds that tie families together are special, and only when setting aside your differences and understanding the intentions of one another can a family grow stronger together. Monsters University teaches us that a big goal can sometimes only be achieved through working together. A big part of the movie revolves around teamwork, and by playing off each other's strengths while also reconciling any differences, a team can overcome a challenge that is bigger than the individual. Now if I had to recommend one Pixar movie that you have to show any child, it's Inside Out. The film is an inspiring look at how we manage our emotions. Having a healthy balance of emotions is a natural element of growth, and while we naturally crave joy, it's sometimes other emotions like sadness that help define the joyous moments and give meaning to some of our most treasured memories. The Good Dinosaur is a coming-of-age movie and its main lesson is that courage allows us to grow through adversity. While we can't do everything on our own, putting ourselves in unfamiliar and often scary situations is key to gaining experience and learning how to handle new situations. Finding Dory's lesson can pretty much be summarized in the quote, just keep swimming. The deeper meaning behind this is that sometimes we may face huge obstacles and we may not know how to solve them, but if we just keep swimming, in other words, keep moving forward, not even short-term memory loss can stop us from making progress and bringing about change. In Cars 3, it's tempting to talk about the increasing importance of data analytics in the modern world. The main lesson is actually that, while we should always be taking the initiative to succeed ourselves, we should also provide others with opportunities to flourish, especially future generations. Coco is a film rich in culture, tradition, and heritage, and it teaches us the importance of memory and that the people and cultures we love live on as long as we remember and honor them. There's definitely some commentary here about how quickly our world changes and an element of remembering where we came from. Incredibles 2's lesson is that media can be informative but dangerous. The power of media to influence us in today's world is a widely discussed topic, and we should always be aware that changing something is very different from changing our perception of that something. Toy Story 4 emphasizes once again that moving on is a natural part of life. There are times in life where we can choose to stay put or we can choose to move on to new surroundings, letting go of what we thought to be unbreakable bonds, but forging new bonds with a new outlook on life. Onward shows us that while it's always natural to want more, we should always appreciate what we have and recognize the value that the people around us bring, even if it's just the little things. Achieving this balance of desire and gratitude will allow us to live more satisfactory lives. And finally, Soul is a masterclass in demonstrating the power of life. It helps us understand that whether you believe you have a life purpose or not, the most fulfilling way to live life is to have an open mind to living. It's not an easy concept to grasp, but the common saying that it's not the destination, but the journey that matters most would apply here. And that life is not just about achieving your dreams, but living in the moment as much as you can for every step of the journey. This is a highly recommended watch and is a fitting end to the list for now. And there you have it guys, what do you think was the most important lesson from each Pixar movie? Let me know in the comments below, I'd love to start a discussion with you. Thank you so much for watching that video guys, I will be back with a new one soon. So until next time, stay safe, stay hyped, and I'll see you next time.